西坡皮坡皮坡皮坡，克帕萨萨帕西瓦德多。Welcome to Crime Time News, where the difference is in the meds. Call it news with a buzz. People, have you ever seen a video in which it disturbs you so much? When you see a video like this, you are wondering, as a parent, as a father, as a mother, if you saw your daughter, your relative getting a royal B E A T down by a set of boys, by a set of girls, how would you actually react as a parent, as a father? I am speaking about an incident that occurred in a place called Ashford. Ashford is in UK, somewhere in Surrey. Don't quote me on this. It is said that the incident occurred in the junction of Sucumber Road and Stanwell Road at about 2:30 p.m. Based on what the report is saying, there was some sorts of altercation between a group of girls. However, people, the truth and the fact is that this was an altercation. Are a royal B E A T down by a mother, thirty-nine year old, her sixteen year old, her eleven year old, her ten year old, and also a forty-three year old man. So pretty much them G A N G up on this little girl. Needless to say, this little girl was B L A C K. The people that was doing the B E A T down. They were Irish. They were W H I T E. They were definitely R A C I S T. Now, in this very disturbing video that is making its round all over social media, you could see a mother look like some sort of bull bucker, tough, look like some sort of T R A I L trailer park. You know me. I talk about trash. She and her kids. Them I tell the people them move out of the way. They were headed towards this sixteen-year-old B L A C K girl because of YouTube's policy. I cannot play this video. It violates their policy. However, I can tell you exactly what happened. The mother walk over, pointed out. The girl to her bigger daughter, bigger daughter, like me say, is about sixteen year old. That sixteen year old rush the sixteen year old other girl. When the other girl seems to have been getting the upper hand on her, the mother sending the second bigger girl or bigger daughter. Every time the daughter would lose the advantage, she would send in another child. So therefore, at most times, at least two, three, sometimes four, including the mother, was all up on this girl. May I talk about K I C K? May I talk about Mike Tyson? May I talk about the uppercuts? They they were giving her the whole assortment. She was the only one that I saw was B L A C K in the whole thing. I am speaking about men were out there. I am speaking about people in a car. Me a talk about passerby, pedestrian. Everybody was there, including a group of W H I T E picnic. None of them assisted, including the adults that were there, that were driving by and just looking. People, based on the reaction of the W H I T E people that I saw. It is obvious that they were okay with it. It was obvious that they did not see absolutely anything wrong with the action of this mother. A man don't know the relationship, and also three or four other picnic, ages eleven, ages sixteen, ages I think thirteen. So therefore, the mother is about thirty-nine year old. The man that was with them. 
was 43. The ages again, like I said, 16, 11, 10 people. It was crazy. It was also said that a teacher and possibly the principal of the school, he was also there. They also called for backup. The school was just down the street, across the road or whatever this, the case is. People come. There was no sort of urgency. The video that I saw was maybe about two minutes or so long. I did not see any sorts of urgency. The popo was not there. When the popo came, other persons were outraged, meaning other parents, other persons not living in the vicinity that were more than likely B-L-A-C-K. They were outraged. There was a public outcry by everybody. Like I said, this video is making its round. I cannot show the video because of YouTube's policy. However, I am going to send it to my WhatsApp group, 1-876-894-2711. Send me a text. Do not call. Do not video call me. Send me a text and say you want the video about the little incident in a Ashford or wherever the place name in a UK. Sorry, somewhere in there. Now, people, when we see videos like this, and sometimes we see videos with children and them do some disturbing thing. It is because this child is probably B-U-L-L-I-E-D, taking advantage of, get a royal B-E-A-T down like this child in the video look like she's about 16. Them hold her, them push her, them do everything under the sun that you could do to anybody them all are here which was long look like some sort of weave and them wheel it them pull it them pop it them them do everything to her there was nothing that was missing none at all she basically get the whole assortment of a royal b-e-a-t down had she been by herself with even the biggest daughter she was going to take her out however the mother being a coward. 39 year old lady along with a 43 year old man and three at a picnic decided that this was some sorts of bright idea. Just imagine this little girl went home. Her father of some sorts of peace, whether it is legal or illegal, and decides that the next day or later on she was going to come back for some sorts of revenge just imagine this girl having a father or a mother that is like the typical person whenever them picnic get any sorts of a b u s e them have that hen and chicken m o that means that they are going to defend their child to d e a t h they don't mind taking out somebody for it just imagine if these people, this girl, did not make sensible heads prevail. Me just I say, suppose these people decided that they wanted R-E-V-E-N-G-E -E -E for what had happened to their own, their daughter, whatever the case is. Could you blame them? Could you wrong them? Maybe. In the eyes of the court, they would say that, yes, allow the law to give you the justice. But people, sometimes you just cross the line. Sometimes purses are going to snap. Sometimes it is going to be the straw that brought the camels back. You could not blame a mother or a father if they went out of character and did the most extreme stuff after seeing this or hearing about this people it was that bad and the worst thing is that purses meaning adults were there people from the school people in the neighborhood people that walk by in a car everybody just a look that means uh, pretty much they endorse it and based on information that i am getting 
The little child that was A B U S E D. She born right there so in a England, in a UK, wherever the incident occurred. However, the people that were doing it, meaning the mother, they are from Ireland. Don't know what type of immigration treaty them have with them or if they are legal there. Me not really know the policy. It is said that they are called travelers. They are called gypsies. They are known R-A-C-I-S-T. So people, what you think can happen if people now decide, say, eh, a that on a do? We want back some sorts of R-E-V-E-N-G-E -E -E, and then there is some sorts of double A R. Not to say that it is justified, but me just as say, whenever stuff like this happens, it can cause a whole bunch of repercussion. It can cause a whole bunch of innocent people. People, me just as say, not everybody that is some sorts of gypsy come from IRE land, is R-A-C-I-S-T. However, a whole bunch of them are. And based on information that I am getting, it is a fact that a lot of these persons that are labeled, that I just call gypsy from Ireland, they are R-A-C-I-S-T. Not every one of them because you have good and you have bad in all sorts of R-A-C-E people. This is very disturbing. 2023 in a UK. However, people, we know that when it comes to UK and it comes to America, yes, they will downplay it. It is not as blatant or brazen. This is just a very disturbing reminder that you have people out there still like they were back in the 60s or 50s. B-L-A-C-K people are still targeted by these persons. The good thing is that five persons are under arrest right now. The mother, 39 year old. The man, 43 year old. The daughter, 16, 110, 111. They are also looking for some sorts of 15 year old. The school, they are pretty much trying to quell the whole situation. The poor poor cont contacted them and they are doing some sorts of investigation. Hopefully, they will get to the bottom of this. Hopefully, this girl and her family will get some sorts of justice. Me no know what kind of justice they can get that would make them feel any more comfortable. Unless... That girl could do back to them what they did to her. However, we understand that that might not happen. Hopefully, this family and other families that go through any sorts of stuff like this at the hands of any other RACE will sue them, get them locked up, get time, and also have some sorts of civil law suit for violating their human and civil rights, point blank and period.